Okay, YouTube, I want to make a quick little video here. Uh, this harness is off of a 96 or 97 Chevy Express van. Um, it was actually our shop van that we had left go for quite some time, but what happens um, with these is, well, long story short, the sockets go bad. But the symptoms were, um, say you're sitting there, you have the headlights on, and obviously the parking lights will be on as well. Um, these two bulbs would be lit with one filament. Um, turn your turn signal on, this one up here blinks the second filament. Uh, however, if you hit your brakes, this one down here is supposed to get brighter by illuminating the second filament. But what happened was, say these two bulbs are on because your lights are all on, hit your brakes, this one stays the same, which is normal. This one, the lower one, goes completely out, and the third brake light was coming on, so that told me the switch and everything was working, but that's the only brake light that worked was the third brake light. This one went out. Um, just so happened that it was left go so long, the other side was also bad, it went out as well. Um, you could have potentially just one side that goes out, but... Um, but yeah, like I said in the beginning of the video, what happens is these sockets go bad. We <laughs> kind of scratched our heads for a little bit because it's, I don't know, I thought it was kind of weird that the socket went bad internally like that, but it's not too far-fetched. But we checked the ground down where it uh, attached to the body at the behind the wheelhouse in a van. Uh, we checked that. It was fine. We back-probed the socket up here. Ground checked fine. We also checked the power feed, which we were getting the power but wasn't lighting the bulb it would actually just go out which was kind of strange what we ended up doing to prove our theory that it was bad within the socket is since these bulbs kind of stick up out a little bit you can see the the bait not the base but the steel ring that goes around it there this part is the ground um, since they stick up out a little bit we just took a t-pin and a known good ground wire and Touch it on there when somebody was on the brakes and voila, they worked as they should. Um, like I said, turns out we had two bad sockets, one on the left side, one on the right side. And that's just because it was left go for so long. One, I'm sure they didn't fail at the same time, but um, we replaced this whole harness to do all the uh, sockets. Just because it was easier than splicing in and this one's already been <laughs> hacked up for whatever reason. But but yeah, long story short, sockets go bad on these vans. I'm guessing some of the pickups use these same sockets, but hopefully this helps someone out. Uh, like, comment, and subscribe. See ya.